What up, y'all? It's your boy Chance, and I just wanted to come on here and, you know, talk to you guys a bit about some stuff, you know, because I do have a lot on my mind. <laughs> you guys don't know I am watching basketball wise on the H1. It's, it's pretty interesting what they go through, but I just wanted to, you know, kick it with y'all for a bit and just kind of, you know, chill and relax. Like, like I know I'm constantly doing live streams, and that's. Yeah. But uh, I do want to be real with y'all for, a, you know, just a bit and just kind of, you know, talk to you guys about what's really going on and about why I feel the way I do about me wanting a normal life again. And for those of you that may or may not know, or whether you have or have not seen my live stream from, you know, yesterday, um, I didn't originally intend on doing music as a career. I really didn't. Like, it just, it literally happened. And the way that it just kind of happened was I made a beat just messing around, being funny. You know, just something to do. I was super bored, so I was like, fuck it. You know, I went on to Loop Labs. I made a beat just kind of fucking around, you know. And then, you know, a buddy of mine was like, yo, like, you should seriously, you should take it seriously. Like, it's really good. And I thought he was joking. I honestly, I swear to God, I thought he was joking. And jokingly, you know, I literally, and I was, I was going along with it. I was like, haha, very funny, you know. And he was like, you should really post this up, and blah, blah, and I, at the time, I thought it was, I thought it was honestly a continuing joke. I really did, like, I honestly thought it was a joke, so I jokingly put it up, I learned how to do it. You know, I learned how to put up my music and stuff on, like, SoundCloud and stuff like that. Because back then, I didn't know how to use YouTube that well, so I didn't really, like, know how to you know, create a proper video for music, so I was like, all right, you know, whatever, you know, I'll skip YouTube, and I put it up on Reverb Nation SoundCloud, and people started listening left and right, and just literally from there, it took off, literally, it took off. And ever since, I've not heard from my friend one bit. Like, it's, like, I don't know if he moved. I don't know, like, what happened, but I lost touch with him after that. Like, and it sucks. Like, I never asked for this. I really didn't. The one thing I did ask for, though, is to be able to do baseball, but I can't even do that due to my age and me not being able to afford the camps. But outside of that, you guys really don't understand the stress that a music artist like myself goes through. I go through a lot more than you guys even can imagine. I'm always being watched by everyone on social media. I'm always being put in the spotlight. But, you know, like, it... You guys don't get it. Like, it's very stressful always being in the spotlight 24-7. 
10 years ago before I did music, I had a normal life. Y'all want to know what I did before I started doing music full time? I sat down, I hung out with my friends. I hung out with my friends, I played video games with them, I had fun with them, we went out, we rode around, we got dirty, we skated, we did whatever. We had normal lives, I had a normal life. But now because of that, I lost a lot of my friends in that process, friends that I should not have lost. Because they noticed I was changing, and they're right, I was changing. And I regret that change. I regret being the guy that I was when I first started out. Like I said, I never asked to, you know, be this artist that I am now. I never asked for that. And honestly, I just want my normal life back. That's all I fucking want. I don't want this fame that I've got. I don't want that anymore. At first, yeah, it was all good. And then I realized the price that it cost. And I'm not willing to pay that price. I will not pay the price of my friends for fame. I refuse to do it. I'll take my friends over fame any fucking day of the week. Because my friends are always there. The fame will not always be there. The fame can do this and fuck off. I will not have anything to do with fame. Like I said, yeah, like running my own custom clothing shop, doing YouTube channels, stuff like that. That's normal stuff. At least with that, you can be more or less normal. With music, you're always in the spotlight. Everybody always, always, always watching you. Like, legitimately always watching. And it's... You guys just don't get how hard that is. It's a lot harder than you guys realize. Like, what you guys don't see... Uh, yeah, I put on a happy face and everything like that, because a lot of the times I am. But a lot of the times, I'm also not. And that's what you guys don't see. You guys don't see the stress, the anger, the, the judgmental side of things. You guys don't see that. All you see is what I post up. You guys don't see the million, uh, the millions... Of, you know, rejections that I get every day. Y'all don't see that. Like, and I'm sorry to those that do enjoy my music, but I can't keep this life up anymore. I cannot live the life of a music artist. It's not me. Yeah, it used to be me, but it's not. The me that I'm used to being was me back in high school before music. Back when I was in high school, I always, always was playing sports. I was always playing baseball. I was hanging out with my friends. I was having a normal life. And... You know, like, I want to be that normal person again. Which is why I have to remove myself away from the music as much as you guys might hate that. And I understand that you guys hate it because you guys love what I do. But you guys have to understand how mentally and physically draining it is on me. And how stressful it is. Because back before I did music, I used to do artwork. I used to do comic book characters, everything. I used to have fun. I used to be normal. But now, what is normal? Me opening up my email, getting a rejection letter, 
working on music, busting my ass, not sleeping hardly. And you guys don't understand that. With all this going on, I, like, literally, I barely sleep now because I'm always busting my ass working on my stuff. I am always busting my ass 24-7, 365. I barely have any time for sleep. Like, maybe one to two hours of sleep. That's it. Then I'm right back up. And that's what the music industry has done to me. That's what doing music has done to me. It's caused me to lose sleep. And it's caused me to lose friendships. It's caused me to always be stressed out. Being upset. Being judged. Being bullied. And nobody seems to give two shits about that. Nobody sees what I go through. You guys don't see that. There's very fucking few of you that actually see that side of things. You guys don't understand the stress that it is. Like, you guys don't understand the stress that I have every day from music. Every day I'm constantly thinking, all right, I did this. What can I do to top this? What can I do that people will like and not judge me on? What will this person think? What will these people think? What will these record labels think? You know, how can I do this and this? That's always going through my mind. And it, it sucks. So I'm sorry to say, guys, but I am stepping down from music for a good long time. And so I feel I'm ready to come back. I don't know when I'm going to come back to doing music. I don't know if I'll even come back to doing music. Who knows? Maybe, you know, me stepping away from this is the next step that I need to take. But I'm sorry, guys. I need to be normal again. Like I was when I was in high school. Like around my best friend Sam, who's actually watching this as well. Before music, I was normal. Before music, I actually had time for my friends. I had time for family. I had time to sit down and watch a really good anime show. I had time to do things I really enjoy doing. But now I don't have that time. And it kills me. And that's why... Because I've been working non-stop for 10 years. 24-7, 365. Non-stop. Birthdays, holidays, it didn't matter. But that's why after tonight, I am taking a break away from music for a very good long time. Because I need that mental and physical break. It is physically and mentally draining my health. It is literally draining my insanity. And it's causing me to lose friends that I don't need to be losing. So from here on out, guys, aside from, like, you know, my photography and my artwork, you guys will not be hearing any music out of me for a while. I mean, occasionally I'll post up remixes or stuff that I've done from, like, 10 years ago, but that's it. Other than that, I will not be posting any new music. I will not be doing anything music-wise for a while. I'll be focusing on my shop. I'll be focusing on my artwork, my photography, and that's it. I'm sorry, guys. I can't do this. I need a break longer than a month. I need that break. I need to get back to where I used to be. I need to be myself. I need to be normal again. I want my life back to how it was before I started doing music where I could actually be normal. I'm not saying that I want to quit music, but I want that normalcy back. I want that sense of being normal back. And I hope you guys understand that. So with that being said, I'm going to check these last few messages. I'm going to put on a damn good anime on here. 
on YouTube. And I'm going to crash out for the night. And I will see you guys tomorrow. So, good night to you guys. Love you all. See you guys in the morning. Peace.